Hi everyone, on behalf of the HP Helion team and Frame Group, we'd like to welcome you all to GovHack 2015. So if you've come to this um, video, then you've obviously come and spoken to our team um, and you've been given access to our Helion development platform, which is built on Cloud Foundry and Docker. And you're obviously wanting to use that to be able to host your application that you're building for GovHack. So what I'm going to do is take you through the steps that you need to be able to do to access and to be able to push your application code to the Helion development platform. First of all, you'll need to go and start up your favorite browser. So once you do that, then you'll need to go to https colon slash slash api.helionit.es and when you go to that URL, you'll get the Helion development platform loading. Now the team would have given you a username and a password. So what I'll get you to do is to enter that username and password and that will grant you access onto the platform and sign you in. Once you've signed in, the first thing you'll want to do is to go and download the command line interface so that you can use the command line tools to be able to push your application um, up into the application space of Cloud Foundry and Docker. So all you need to do is go in and click the download client. And when you do that, it will give you some options in terms of which one you wanna go and download. So if you're running Mac, use that one, Windows or a Linux environment. The other thing to remember, if you need to know more information, please go and read the read documentation section. Okay. Um, and that will be able to help you out with uh, more information about the platform um, or come and see the group and we're happy to, um, to help you to be able to uh, upload your applications. So next you'll need to go and write yourself um, some application code um, using your favorite IDE or uh, uh, and using uh, either Java, PHP, Node.js, Ruby, um, or Python. Um, so I've just got a, real, a small Java application here uh, that I've written. Uh, then I'm gonna need to go and build that. So I'll just run a build on it. Okay, so the build's complete. And now I can actually go and, uh, and, run, and, and push my application, okay? So to do that, you're actually going to need to know that URL that I specified before, okay? So which was the HTTPS um, colon slash slash API, um, because we're going to need to target that uh, when we go and um, and actually push our code. So let's do that now. So that's the this is just the command line editor that I downloaded before. Um, and first of all, I'll go and target. for that target to go up and it's exactly the same URL. Um, and then I'm gonna log in. So I'll use exactly the same login as what I used for the, for the command line. Okay. All right, so I've successfully logged in and it's put me to the organization of GovHack AU and my space is test at the moment. So let's go and try and push that application that I just built. So yes, I want to deploy it. I'm just going to use the standard information. Okay, so sometimes it will give you a minor error on the authorization, but you can just um, push it again and it'll, it'll go straight up. Um, I, don't need to bind, I don't need to bind any services to this. Okay, so that's actually starting, trying to start the application now. So if we go back into our GUI, we should be able to see the application starting to come up. Okay, and there it is. So it's in a state of starting. Okay, so it's going to take a little while for this to come up. Um, so I'll just pause for the moment and we'll come back once it's back up and running.
All right, so you can see that um, the command line interface is now telling me that that's been deployed. So if we go back to our GUI, um, we're now seeing that we're online. Okay, if you need to check your logs uh, to find out what's going on, you can go into the log stream and it'll give you an update in terms of what it's done um, and any stack traces that might appear um, in case it fails. Uh, but now let's just try and view the app. It's just a really simple um, HTTP push um, saying welcome to GovHack and that it's a test application by me. Okay, so that's all up and running. Um, and you can see it now and control it. Um, you can also load balance it as well. So um, you can go into the instances and you can turn on your auto scaling and things like that too because it is a, a full Cloud Foundry um, running uh, service. So if you have any problems, uh, please feel free to come and see us. Uh, we want to try and help as many teams as we can to be able to uh, host their applications on the HP Helium development platform, uh, which as I said is Cloud Foundry and Docker. Um, if you have or need more information about it, just don't go and do a Google search. Um, there's plenty of documentation out there um, to help you along. Uh, have a great time at uh, GovHack and um, we look forward to meeting you all and helping you out. Thanks very much. Bye.